Okay, guys. Sorry for that interruption. Battery died on me. But anyways, here we are at the Deer Catch Pen Loop. And uh, we're going to drop in with you. And you can see we got some clear skies here, but with all probability it's going to rain some more. So we do have our rain gear on. We do have our cell phone on. We do have it on the uh, the map here, the, the uh, trail forks. So uh, we're going to get rocking and rolling here. Car is locked up. And we're going to do this 8.2 mile ride. And guess who's coming along? We're going to fire this beast up. There we go. She just popped up. We've got a full charge battery. And uh, she always fires, when you first turn it on, it's always in low gear. Let's just see what's cooking here. Wish me luck, gentlemen. We're gonna drop in this baby 1,700 feet downhill. Not for the meek at heart. <laughs> I wonder which way we should go, gentlemen. We're gonna go down this hill, just this side here for just a little bit. Oh boy. <laughs> this ain't bad. We're going to be feathering our front brake here too. Very lightly, slightly. We've got a heavy bike here. You know, I just try to figure out which way is the best way to go. Oh, we got a little bit of a root system here. Geez, I don't think my bike can make it over that bump. Yeah, it did. Okay. You're with us. The Deer Creek 10 Catch Loop. I don't know who comes up with names for these things. I'll show you something here real quick. Oh man, I love this fucker. <laughs> we do have our GPS on like I was telling you. We do have the camera on. We I did want to take a take a look at the mileage. We've got 158. So that way we know we got the map plus the mileage. Uh, oh uh added one of these uh, little rubber for my uh, ram mounts this little piece of rubber that holds it down just I just felt better doing it with putting that piece of piece of uh, rubber on there to hold it in because it, it it could flick right it, you think that it could flick right out of there and you can't torque it down too tight because if you do If you torque it down too tight, you could crack your screen on your phone. Yeah, we're just gonna take it nice and slow and easy, guys. It's my first time on this trail, so we're just gonna milk the clock, shall we say. Take it easy, slow, get to learn the trail a little bit. I'm a little apprehensive and I may put my phone away instead of having it out there like that because if I bite the dust that phone is gonna and on a trail like this it's 
very conceivable you could have some complications. <laughs> Shit, I might fucking put the... I might turn the power off on this beast. But you don't want to do that either. You guys are here on the Deer Creek Catch Pen Loop, eight miles. Oh! Oh, we've got some, that's cattle shit right there. So we do have cattle out here. I guess that's why they call it the Catch Pen Loop. Somebody's got cattle up here, so. This is pretty nice. This is pretty nice, man. I could go, maybe I should put that phone away, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it tends to want to move. Yeah, see how it's kicking over? That's why I feel much better. I may put it away, I don't know for sure. I'm not quite used to it, that's why we're taking it easy too. Like I said, I, I think I should put the phone in my pocket. And then I could ride a little stronger. Cause it'd be less likely to bite the bite down on the barrel, shall we say? Looks like we got a little dipsy here. <laughs> There's that torque, guys. <laughs> Gentlemen, we just gotta take it a little bit easy. Shit, we did that for that. I could have went down the wash. I tell you, you get the 1,700 feet, most of it is here. Most of that fall is right here. We just came off the edge of the mountain. Deer catch pen loop. Beautiful day in May, 50 degrees. Fuck, I'm loving life. I don't normally like 50, but I'll take it. You get if you're dressed, if you're dressed for it on a bike. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm thinking real serious about one. 